let us pray. O God, who in creating the human race willed that man and wife should come, should be one, join, we pray, in a bond of inseparable love, these your servants, Raymond and Maureen, who are to be united in the covenant of marriage, so that as you make their love fruitful, they may become, by your grace, witnesses to charity itself. To our Lord Jesus Christ, the Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. then built up into a woman the rib that he had taken from the man. When he brought her to the man, the man said, this one at last is bone of my bones and flesh of my flesh. This one shall be called woman. For out of her man, this one has been taken. That's why a man leaves his father and his mother and clings to his wife. And the two of them become one body. Love is patient, love is kind, it is not jealous, it is not pompous, it is not inflated, it is not rude, it does not seek its own interests, it is not quick-tempered, it does not brood over injury, it does not rejoice over wrongdoing, but rejoices with the truth. Have you come here to enter into marriage without coercion, freely and wholeheartedly? Say, I have. I have. <laughs> Look at you. Do you take Maureen to be your wife? Do you promise? to be faithful to her in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love you and to honor you all the days of your life? I do. Maureen, do you take Raymond to be your husband? Do you promise to be faithful to him in good times and in bad, in sickness and in health, to love him and to honor him all the days of his life? I am. I do. Hey, let's hear you well. I do. Good. <laughs> Keep you of one heart in love for one another, that the peace of Christ may dwell in you and abide always in your home. Amen. 
May you be blessed in your children, have solace in your friends, and enjoy true peace with everyone. Amen. May you be witnesses in the world to God's charity, so that the afflicted and needy who have known your kindness may one day receive you thankfully into the eternal dwelling of God. Amen. May the Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my great pleasure to formally introduce to you Mr. and Mrs. Raymond and Maureen Eforiata. And they can kiss the bride right now. So Raymond told me, you know, uh, I saw this girl and he's just the perfect spec I've been looking for. And Raymond was re literally shaking. I'm like, Raymond, calm down, calm down. You know, so she checks all the boxes. I say, who is this girl? He kept telling me. I'm like, okay. It seems you like her. He said, of course. You know, that's the person that meets my spec, you know. So uh, eventually, here we are today. So Maureen, uh, I know I've told you that before. So Raymond said he checked all his boxes. So that was in yesterday, so we're in today. So today now we're married, and congratulations to both of you. as much as I love my own blood sisters. You are beyond giving, extremely intelligent, witty, charming, driven. You deserve all the happiness in the world. And I'm so grateful that you found your perfect match in Raymond. Your kindness, compassion, and incredible sense of humor light up every room you enter. And I'm thankful to Raymond for making your bright smile even brighter. 